Hello, everybody. Hello. Hello. And welcome back to Everything But the Goblin. <laughs> Indeed. And in this part, we're going to try to go back right. This is kind of a hard puzzle. I I'm joking. Of course. I'm yeah, you need a grappling hook, though. <laughs> oh, if only that existed in this whole... In any case, yeah, I guess this is the only thing we can do. 14th place! Yay! You goofed around and you still got 14th place. <laughs> Not bad. On personal safety. Architects who wish to ensure their own safety should invaders penetrate their dungeon are advised to create a panic room. This comprises a small central chamber into which the architect can lock him or herself, surrounded by a number of defences, designed to be as deadly or devious as the architect sees fit. Through the use of green doors or sister doors, complex arrangements can be set up such that, should the invader succeed in killing the room's inhabitant, they themselves will become trapped. Oh, great. That, that scares me. Inner defences is where we're going. Oh gosh, this is. Why I did see you my start a room? Why couldn't you make this more fancy? Just like a giant square of nothing. <laughs> oh, ah! <laughs> There's a goblin! <gasps> Finally! Goblin! And wubbas. <laughs> Yay, wubbas! Uh, so this room looks like we're gonna have to exit and re-enter it a billion times. Yep. This would be a nice level for a beacon. Um, so I'm guessing this is where we want to enter. Okay, so we're solving a ton of different puzzles with the goblin. Yeah. So where do we want the goblin? Hmm. Can we get the goblin down here just with us? Without getting ourselves stuck there, so like no nope, there's an arrow so i don't know if this is where we want the goblin it looks like the answer is no okay we don't want the goblin stuck either though no maybe we do is there a reason to have him not stuck <laughs> oh boy Okay, so we can kill the goblin. Well, once why, we kill do I, why do I think that's probably not the solution? <laughs> yeah, I don't think we want to kill the yeah. goblin, do we? It's I'm not pretty what we sure came don't. here for. Yeah. Let's open that up. Can't kill the goblin because he's gonna kill. Why can't we kill the goblin? Because I think we need to exit uh, to the right. And that closes the sister door. Alright. Well then, we'll open up this path up here, except now where do we go? I'm actually not even sure where we're supposed to go in this maze. Is there anywhere where these bombs cannot blow up anything? You could always get the goblins stuck there. Any ideas, anybody? What affects the uh, the vertical door that's near the briar root? This on the other side of the level. Oh. Oh, this door? No, the vertical one. This one. This mm. switch here. So that's probably part of another pass through. I was just wondering because of that tunnel. Yeah, it's but, just yeah. pass through. Okay. Uh, so we're going to have to do this room eight times, and do eight other rooms. Maybe the other rooms will, will be um, four squares big like the one we started on. Okay, that'd yeah, that's be true. Nice. That'd be nice. <laughs> so what is this goblin? What can the goblin do that's any good? I don't think there's any safe spots, is there?
see if there's any safe spots. So the reason we do not want this door to close. No, I don't think there's any safe spots, is there? Yeah, so I think the call is gonna have to be on the move, or you can, or you move it around yourself to avoid the explosions. Oh, that's true. We could do that. Or he's brained. Where's a brain? He's brained. Uh, is he? The Wubbers aren't acting brain, so I don't think so. Well, he's programmed to be brain then. No, I think I think he just uh, yeah, he just all... goes around uh, by yeah, force of habit. Yeah, you know, go because go goblins can move around single obstacles. Yeah, no, but right here it's definitely a double obstacle. No, because it's it's diagonal, so he so. He's moving around a single obstacle twice. <laughs> oh. This confuses me. Okay, I can get him stuck there. But you can move down after that. Then again, he could go around a level. Uh, the room, I mean. Because there's nothing stopping you, really. Oh, yeah, that's true. Well, actually... Theoretically, he could go in here and go up here with us. Gets us in the same position as earlier, though. Yeah. Okay, yeah, like you said, we could go all the way around here. Wabos don't do anything yet. Then we could get him to go back over here. But is there anywhere we can get him stuck without him dying? Not stuck. permanently, anyway. Yeah. Uh. Because he's gonna get stuck there no matter what. I don't think we want him stuck. Because <laughs> we need this to open up. Yeah. This closes on us if we hit this, but it opens up this. I don't think they make it where you have to walk around the entire thing, though. Okay, let's get him stuck there for now and just... We can always get him back up if we need to. Um... Or we could just... Keep him there. Yeah. That seems like it works. But then wait, we can. I think we can bring it with us, actually. As long as it doesn't cause any trouble. Wait, why is he running that way? When I hit this. Because he really wants to avoid a square that's next to your sword. What square? If he goes right here, I can't escape. Yeah, but he was on that square. <laughs> But wouldn't he follow me and go right here? No, uh, because that's next to your sword. But it would yeah. take two turns to swing my sword, wouldn't it? Yeah, but, well, the, well, but you, could back, you could backswipe if if that wall wasn't there. And yeah. he doesn't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> so then where do we want this mimic? Here, let's just place it somewhere and see what happens. So this door is open by hitting that switch, which this is opened by hitting that switch also. <laughs> Perhaps you need well, the Hold on, there's a break. broken wall. That arrow that's on a wall, yeah. I think that's broken. Yes, it is. Maybe yeah. that's what the mimic's for. Right down here? Yeah. But then what do we do back down here? How does this open? Oh, the mimic needs to go over here. Hmm. Yeah. 
And that actually I think that uh, when the bombs are exploding you can keep the goblin on that bottom square of the vertical door. Where? Uh, undo back to when the bombs are exploding. Oh, right here? Yeah. Good night. Oh, there, yeah. I don't know if that door can open again, though. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. What happens if I just did this? What reason will we need this? Oh, I see. The wall's broken, so now we can... I think we probably need him to go... Yeah, we can actually use the tunnel to maybe get him to move around now. Then, either, when you step back, either you die or he dies. So bad about him dying. I don't know. It seems undesirable. This lets me out. Then I think the walls, uh, the blue doors are gonna fall, and I don't know if we want that just yet. Well, we still haven't got. A, oh, we have got an exit from the room in the southwest. Yeah, but maybe, um, oh, I, I don't want to, can I use a checkpoint? Because I don't want this to be irreversible. <laughs> Alright, what happens if, okay, none toes, right? These are just all single room. So yeah, now what do we do? Okay, yeah, all the, no, none of the blue doors are open because we haven't gone every way. Still, this is probably not good. Probably not. Um... Should, should the goblin live? I think it has to. Otherwise, it probably wouldn't just be this complicated setup. And as the description said, actually, the system would close you in if you killed the the person inside. Right. We still, we still haven't worked out why it's necessary to keep the goblin alive, and that's not entirely satisfying. Um, this door remains closed. Huh? I mean, we can never... Huh? I'm guessing something like this might be the last direction. Uh, guys, am I the only one who has lagging voices? Yeah, I think so. Huh? Yes. Because on my end, uh, the voice is a bit distorted and lagged. Are you having the same thing, Nuntar? Sorry? Are you even lagging voices? I'm still here. Oh, you can hear me? Hello? Hello? No, you've Hello? Gotten, uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, it went, geez, it went funny weird. for a minute or so. <laughs> okay, so... Is it better though? Yeah, I think right. so. So nothing opens this. Well, we could always do something like that. Okay, wait, let's go back. Okay, the, I think the video just, uh, yeah, it's starting to lag a bit. Oh no. Yeah. Hmm. No! <laughs> Technical difficulty. No! Everything was going so well. I know, right? Uh. How can we even utilize this mimic? Oh. No, you you, you go back down there where you where you belong. Wait, go back right here. Okay, that leaves an exit. Now the only <laughs> problem is was there a bomb originally there? Yes, there was originally a bomb blocking. Wait. Can't I just, um... Originally go ahead and break this wall right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so bloody simple. Yeah. Mm. 
I need to be facing a different way. If I can help it. Yeah. Preferably without dying. <laughs> yeah, that would help. Well, which hmm. way? Oh, hmm. there we go. Wait, why does that close that? Did it do that last time? Yeah, it did. Alright, so go down there. Up there, down there. Back down there. Hit that open. Don't kill the goblin. <laughs> Push him down there. Stay, stay away from us. And then go ahead and go down the bottom left path. All right. Hooray! Goblin lives. And I'll For now. Again. <laughs> All right. So that's the first puzzle done. Yeah. Now what? A uh, trapdoor puzzle with a goblin. That's what. So this opens this, which we want. But we need the red door to be dropped. This so we door. need to go around and drop the trap doors. Yes, without the goblin moving, preferably. Yeah, and also the ones on the sides, I think. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Because there's red doors that'll open. So yeah, we need to drop the trap doors around the room too. Oh. Oh, that's right, because, yeah. I don't know. Well, we'll find out if this is it. <laughs> mm. Maybe we don't have to drop every red door. No, but there's no way out of there. Unless we drop every red door. Yeah. So it forces you to get rid of every red door. But then... Okay, so the goblin's gonna be in there. Yeah. Now, how do we keep the goblin from getting with us? Well, break there's the, Pokemon. Break the walls and then... Yeah. Just keep him in there, I guess. Oh, I just gotta figure out how. Oh. Which way do we want him? Ugh. I'm getting lag again. No. Yeah, I'm thinking I should maybe drop out and drop back in. All right, you can do that. Hold on, I don't know if it's saying something uh, about the con oh, yeah, the connection, the connection with speed between you and no. Oh, okay, well, yeah. So I've, I'll try to drop out and back and see what happens. I guess. So, All, right. All right. Okay. All right. Hopefully it works better for him. Uh, this is very, very frustrating. I picked the wrong one. Hold on, I'll pause it real quick. Technical difficulty. All right, I'll just I'll work with it. <laughs> All right. Hopefully it stays. Ah. <laughs> All right. So yeah, keep the goblin in there. Wait. Don't break that trap door right away. Yeah. All right. Then keep the goblin back in there. Whoops. Stay. All right. Looks good Wait, to where me. Do we, We're where stuck. do we step off? Yeah, that's true. I think we need to step off on that arrow. <laughs> yeah, the false arrow. Oh, up here. Yeah. All right. That means I gotta. Repick the path I take. Not be so hasty with that decision. Well, that's gonna be. How am I gonna go back this way? Okay, we can keep you there. Where am I gonna put him, or how am I gonna keep him on there? On, keep them on the breakable walls. 
keep one of the rightmost trapdoors to you there, then drop all the trapdoors but the one you need to get out. And then face a certain way I guess and then, no, no I mean the bottom row. Uh, the bottom row that you have right now, drop all but the rightmost one. While avoiding murder by goblin. Here, let's try this. Then try to get that goblin on there and uh, drop the remaining trap doors. Then use your sword to keep him away, I suppose. Yeah. Wait. Can I go back? Go back here. Can I not remove one of these to the right? There we go. Let's try that. Yeah. And go up here. And go back down here. Let me grab that back here. I don't know if that's good or not. Maybe it probably could have kept it. Hmm. I need, I need this one then. Yeah, this is why. Yeah. No! <laughs> He's gonna suicide on me! <laughs> I did not give you permission to suicide. <laughs> Only when the trapdoor room is all dropped, you have my permission to suicide. <laughs> <laughs> That's when you can suicide. Yeah. Oh, I might. Have, oh, I think I want I want a. The thing is, I'm gonna have to exit that way. I have to get yeah. through here. I was gonna say. Well, you could always jump right up here and then go down here. I'm gonna need this spot so I can force them back in here. Yeah. All right, backwards again. Woo! Isn't Woo. that just fun? Woo! Cause I needed those bottom right squares. All right. There, push him in there. There we go. Yay! We did it. Oh, man. <laughs> All right. So we're back here. Checkpoint. Two passes of the room done. Next one is Wubba Filled. Oh no. <laughs> Why'd it have to be Wubbas? <laughs> so I guess our trick here is we're trying to keep the Wubba trapped? Yeah. Or the go we need the goblin trapped. Or the goblin needs to be the one to keep the Wubbas away? Yeah, that too. What is this goblin going to do for us? Well, we could always push him in there. If he just cooperate. I know, right? Something tells me this is not it. Hmm. Wubba's! I think he can have one sleep out at most. From what I'm getting. All right. Oh, we could always. This is what I wanted. Oh. Oh yeah. No, don't die on a goblin. <laughs> Can I like keep him down there? I want you to stay down there. Be a good boy for Aww. me. Video feed seems so frozen for me. It is. It might be because I have so many videos on. <laughs> so many videos recorded. Yeah, I can see on the call quality for information, I'm only at two bars now. Something like that. 
Uh, it's probably me then. Uh. Video quality is low. Hmm. All right. Well, I, I I did get through the room. Okay. All right. It's starting to catch up now. I think. All right. So that was the third pass around. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Try to see if I can remove some stuff. I'm sorry. You have the same problems. More or less. Yeah. All right. It's probably yeah. me then. Yeah. All right, maybe we should stop then, because I have so many videos that are recorded that are probably taking up space. Yeah, that, that can make sense. All right, so next time on <laughs> this whole thing, we got through three of these passes. We'll have to get through five more. All right. So see you then, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye.